everyone, welcome back to the 13th episode of the Melee series. Today we are going to power up by getting more life fruit. We're gonna create a Terra Blade today. We're gonna reforge a Desic a little bit, you know, a little thing. Uh, we're gonna also get a Turtle Armor, and finally we're gonna go make an arena and fight Plant Terra today. So I'm gonna say it's gonna be a pretty fun episode, honestly. And let's get right into the action. Oh hey, look, it's a Plant Terra Ball at the surface of the jungle, nice. Um, I do think we actually do have to fight it in the underground jungle, which... Um, I think it's a lot lower than where we are right now, just because of, um, just because of how the, uh, surface levels work. Like, we're already, um, at 129 underground. Oh, wait, no, then this should work. I don't know if it's when the music kicks in, or when the, um, or when it's, like, actually underground. So, that could be a, a factor in its whole spawning area. Anyways, here's another life crystal, let's go. Now we have half a bar of life fruit stuff, so now we're up to 450. Yeah, and as I said before, the turtle armor and um, the terra blade are gonna require some chlorophyte ore. So we're gonna also go mine for that too along the way while we're looking for some other stuff. And another life fruit. Here we go. Boom. Anyways, guys. So I just wanted to talk about um, the last um, video, not episode. So what you guys think of the Tremor 2 video? Um, personally, um, I think I did pretty good, and not just that, and the fact that um, I'm happy that Tremor 2 is gonna become a mod one day, or at least hopefully it will. Um. But yeah, uh, lots of stuff I want to see from it, lots of uh, things that I think we're going to see from it, and overall, just hopeful for it. Unfortunately, um, something came up recently, and I might have to stop uploading as much as I want to, because I have to take a prep class for um, SATs and stuff. You know, um, as a high schooler, you have to do that kind of stuff, and it sucks, but at least you can get it over with. So yeah, um, however, that's not until like February, so I think we're either going to be almost done with the Melee series, or done by then. Um, and the next series, definitely, we probably do want to get it as soon done as possible. But, um, we're gonna have to see, honestly. Here's another life fruit. Nice, nice. Also, just another little thing that I, um, kind of just thought of. Would you guys like to see a, um, Calamity video soon? Honestly, like, I really do like the Calamity mod. However, I haven't, like, played it in over a year. So, a lot of things such as, like, like, I haven't even play, done Old Duke yet properly. I think I just checked them out, honestly. And one of my, um, and I think my, uh, modded ranger uh playthrough i did once but i never actually fought him like properly so um if you guys would like to see something about calamity then comment down below we're definitely gonna be doing a couple calamity series on this channel as um calamity has a lot of cool aspects to the game that i really want to just check out honestly up oh, here's another life fruit Boom. another life fruit let's go three quarters of the way to full life fruit Another life fruit now. Hey, another life fruit to take. Nice. Oh, okay, we died. Um, I'm surprised we survived as long though. Oh, there's life fruit nearby. But yeah, um, also we have the dungeon right here, so we'll go unlock that after we defeat Plantero. So that's good. That's good. That's good. Hey, another life fruit. Nice. One more. Hey, look. It's our last upgrade. Let's go. Let's go actually back to see uh, what else we can make with the chlorophyte we've got. Um, we've got a decent amount so far, I think. Um, actually, we're going to be getting the Terra Blade now then, too. Nice. Let's go to the Titanium Forge so we can go make our item. All right. And how many bars can we make out of this? A decent amount. Um, we're still gonna need to go back for more for the uh, turtle armor, obviously. But we got enough for what we need right now. The true Excalibur. Find out the true Knight's Edge, and you get. Oh, maybe you have to make it somewhere else. Who knows? You need the uh, um, broken hero sword on uh, the computer or a uh, PC version. But you need. You don't need it on the mobile version, which is already 1.4. That's a bit strange, but okay. Oh, man. We died again, man. Well, that sets us back a bit, but not too much. We gotta have enough uh, chlorophyte to actually make the whole armor set. So, yeah, let's go just quickly check that. Oh, yeah, I definitely think that's enough to go make our set. Let's get out our three turtle shells, and let's make the set of armor. Turtle scale mail, turtle leggings, and the turtle helmet. 
Nice. Let's go. So from 65, hold on, let's see, 65, 150 to 81 and 148. Okay, so it's a little bit less damage. But uh, as we can see from the set bonus attackers, I also take double damage and reduces damage taken by 15%, which is insane. All right, let's go to the underworld so we can actually go um make ourselves the uh what's it called? Not the mechanical glove, the upgrade dog. Well, everyone, it appears we have our magma stone. Nice. All right, let me just kill this red devil. Um, let me pick it up and let me go home the craft stuff of it. Boom, the fire gauntlet. Nice. Let's go. Now let's try to reforge this actually. Ooh, medicine. Okay, you know what? I'll take medicine honestly. That is very, very good. All right, guys. Uh, it's time to go to the jungle map and create our Plantera for our re not Plantera, our arena for Plantera. There we go. So I'll see you guys when I have that done. Oh my God, it's a moth. What the heck? These things are rare. Maybe it'll give us some um, butterfly powder, or more. Maybe not. Uh, anyways. Oh my god, it's another moth. What the heck? Come on, come on. Give us better wings. Uh. Oh, nice. Yeah, let's go. So if we use this and um, so we close the flight, we can get uh, better wings. And honestly, I think I'll do that. Alright everyone, welcome back. We have finished our arena, as you can see. Um, we're seeing campfires, heart lanterns, and the bash statue, which brings us up to 87 defense. We have all our potions as well. So, um, honestly, I think we're pretty ready um, after we defeat some of these enemies right here. Since they can really uh, uh, ha ha hamper the fight. I think that's the right word? Yeah. But anyways, let me just go get them. Go back up, and we're going to go do this fight now. So let's go. I also don't know if I'm gonna talk during much of this fight since it's kind of um hard, and in my opinion, I, I'm not a big Plantera fan. But um, we're gonna be using the death signal for this one. Not only does the projectile uh, damage you with fire, but the projectile just lasts a little bit longer and does a lot more DPS, to be honest, than the um uh, than the Knight's uh, Supreme, not Supreme, True Knight's Edge, honestly. But anyways, this is going pretty good so far. Pretty good, pretty good. We have our circling pattern in uh, tune, honestly. Pretty good. Okay, maybe I was wrong. Maybe I will be talking for most of this fight because it doesn't seem like it's gonna be too bad, except for the spiky balls. Those are like the worst part of the Plantera fight, since they um, are a very bouncy one and two tend to hit a lot of areas that are annoying. Anyways, let's just heal. Okay, we're almost a transformation percentage. I can see around 50% is when that happens. I think. Oh jeez. Okay. Okay. Let's not go down here. At least now, it's, there's only a bit left of the annoyingness of the fight. Oh, we didn't even buff up. God, that's why I've been not doing as good as I thought I would be. Okay, okay, okay. Now we can have the real start. Okay. Alright, alright. Just getting a little bit silenter here because, um... The fight's getting a little bit more tricky. The fight's getting a little bit more tricky. I'm not going to lie. 14 more seconds and then we'll get a heal though. Or around 10 now. Let's go. Alright, alright, alright. So yeah, uh, all in all, this fight was a little bit more interesting, honestly. Also, why did this fight take like two seconds to do? Oh, I'm going to have to close that up. Like seriously, it didn't take that long at all. Oh, uh, let's just um, circle it now. It'll be more effective than taking it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nice, nice, nice. We're also taking out a lot of these um, tentacles too. Great. I think they're called tentacles. Um, I don't, I don't want to stop and see though, so, um, no. And at any moment now, Plantera is dead! Let's go! Screams are echoing from the dungeon, and Plantera has been taken out. And you all know what that means. Next up, after we do the, um, uh, uh, Pumpkin Moon and, uh, Frost Moon, because I really do want to do those. I'm going to be doing that Empress of Light. Yay! Fun. Anyways, let's go back to base. Now let's open this back up in three, two, one, boom. All right, we got the lop scum, not really what we kind of wanted. 
the spore sack, which is pretty cool, and the temple key. Of the temple key, we can open the dungeon and go check that out. So yeah, that's great. Anyways, thank you guys for watching episode 13 of the melee series. Next episode, um, instead of actually doing stuff, we're just gonna chill out um, and um, build some areas, go farm for more um, upgrades and stuff like that. And then after that, we'll do the um, pumpkin moon and frost moon and uh, progress on. So yeah, if you liked the video, uh, consider subscribing, liking, and sharing with a friend. My name is Justin Joe, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. See ya. Really cool weapon. Ah, it's a paladin's hammer. Let's kill them.